What you got there, Lenny? Look at that. We caught a live mussel. Now, these things grow all over those oysters, don't they? They sure do. That's a hooked mussel, and so they filter water just like an oyster. They attach to the reef their food, their habitat, their everything we want on our reef structures. Very cool. You gotta, gotta love it when you pull something nifty alive out of the water that you weren't even expecting. Absolutely. Interesting little fact about this critter. This is actually one of the number one foods of sea ducks that visit the Chesapeake in the wintertime. Huh. So an old school or, or long-tailed duck loves to eat those. It's a majority of their diet. So they swim down to the reef, pick it off, digest the shell and everything, and that's their food. Wow. So it's, it's not just like... fish. Okay. Right down the hatch. You can you can play sea duck. <laughs> no. Nah. You gotta steam them and get them in some butter and garlic before they're really good. <laughs> bottom fishing in the chop tank on one of the many artificial reefs that CCA has a hand in putting around the Chesapeake Bay and its many tributaries in, inside the Chesapeake Bay watershed. So what we can draw here is a direct connection from the work of the Living Reef Action Campaign. If you've ever been out to an artificial reef build, you know that what we're doing is we are creating habitat together. This is why. This is life that we are bringing into an area that was previously lifeless. Really, really cool feature of this part of the bay. Love to see it. Oh, whoa, Ooh, sea bass. It's a maybe. I don't That's, think he's gonna make it. I don't think he's gonna make it either. Next year. Maybe. He's worth measuring. That's right, we'll see him this fall if not. <laughs> yeah. There it is, folks. Whoa, whoa. Oh. Loose fish. Smoky fish, whoa. So a black sea bass typically looked at as an ocean fish. But out here in the Chesapeake, when you have habitat, you will have these reef-dwelling fish, like the black sea bass. That's why we're building these reefs. So that one's gonna be a little short for sure. Need to be 13 inches. It's an inch short. See you next time.